Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. In this tutorial, we are going to fix if keyboard is not working on your laptop or a desktop, then we will install, reinstall the keyboard driver and we will be doing only two simple steps to fix this problem. So the very first step, with the help of mouse, you just need to do a right click on your start icon, whether you're using Windows 10 or Windows 11. So I will click on that and then I'll go to settings. Now at the settings, at the left hand side where we have a lot of options and we need to go to this system and here you will find troubleshoot, just like this. So we need to click on troubleshoot and we need to go to the second, uh, third option which says other troubleshooters. I'll click on that and here we have the most frequent one and in other section we have this keyboard so if your keyboard is not working unplug it and replug it and once it is plugged in then click on keyboard and run the troubleshooter so this will start detecting issues if there is a problem with the keyboard drivers or any any file this will fix the problem see if your keyboard is working fine or not and if it's not we will move to the next step so for that, you just need to do a right click in the start icon again, and then we need to go to this device manager. And the device manager will open up like this. And here in the middle, we will find keyboards. I'll click on that. And here you will find HID keyboard device, standard PS2. So you just need to do a right click in the first one, click on update and search automatically for drivers. And then do the second thing the standard one click on search automatically for drivers if it says the best driver is already installed not an issue just do a right click on the first one click on uninstall device and uninstall and do the second one as well standard ps2 click on uninstall device so you just need to do the right click and uninstall now it says do you want to restart your computer now i'll say no all right, now we need to go to this. Now we don't have keyboard anywhere. Now we just need to go to this action menu and then click on scan for hardware changes. And this will bring back the keyboard. You can see right here, we have successfully uh, have uh, this keyboard device. And the next thing is to plug in and replug your keyboard or you can simply restart the computer and the moment you restart your keyboard driver will be back and it will start working so you can also try that please make sure you restart the computer and see if your keyboard is working fine or not all right so please let me know in the comment section that which step has fixed your problem and i hope you have enjoyed this very short tutorial please hit the like and subscribe i'll see you in the next video have a wonderful day.